Hello you guys! Welcome back to our YouTube channel. My name is Anna and if you're new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe, like and comment. Today we are going to go to the viewpoints of Cebu City and um, I just want to say thank you guys for watching all my videos. I really appreciate it even though I only have a few subscribers. I'm really thankful to those people who watch my videos. Please don't forget to like and always comment and watch the whole video i really really appreciate those people who take their time to watch my videos thank you thank you thank you so much i hope you have a good day today or evening when you watch this video let's go you guys and i'll show you the viewpoints of cebu city <laughs> we are here in the top of cebu so we came here to see a beautiful view of cebu city let's go you guys i'll show you the city of cebu in the top of the mountain it's called the tops <laughs> today is beautiful clear sky today so you can see the beautiful view of the city hello welcome to the city of Talisay, Cebu and Minglanilia I'm showing you guys the beautiful view here. So this is Mactan. This is Cebu City over here. That's in Talisa with a new bridge from Cordoba, Mactan, Lapu-Lapu or Lapu-Lapu, I guess. And that's Minglanilla over there. As you can see, the SMC side over there. there but uh, there's a payment to get in there and we don't want to pay because we're not gonna spend the rest of our night in there so yeah. we will just look in here because we don't have money <laughs> we will just love margo okay and we're gonna go buy some corn next to that area over there and some vegetables yeah let's go let's go So I'm gonna make a vegetable curry or ginataang gulay. I mix all the vegetable that we bought. Ilalagay ko na yung fresh coconut milk. And I will cook it until it's soft. Now I'm adding the long string beans. I boiled the green beans very quick and I'm now mixing the vegetable together. Also adding some salt. I will cover it and let it simmer for a few minutes. Now I'm going to add the uh, eggplant. Hindi ko siya nilagay agad kasi madali lang maluto yung talong. Mm -hmm. 
When the vegetables is almost cooked, I add the first squeezed coconut milk or it's called in Visayan liputo. I will let it boil for one minute. And by the way, I forgot to show you guys that I added dried fish. Sa ginataan kong gulay, mixing it so that the coconut cream will distribute evenly. I will cover it and let it boil for less than one minute and it's finished. So I'm gonna make a suman and now I'm gonna squeeze the fresh coconut milk or the gata. I love using the fresh one because you can really test the yumminess in it and the creaminess. Fresh is always better. Now I'm going to transfer the fresh coconut milk into my clean sticky rice. Now I'm putting the brown sugar. I don't like too much sweet so I just put one and a half spoon and one teaspoon of salt. Now I'm going to put uh, one teaspoon vanilla. It's optional, you don't have to put the vanilla, it's just up to you. I will mix this until the coconut milk absorb to the sticky rice. And now I'm gonna wrap the sticky rice in a banana leaves. I will tie it down so that it doesn't open up sticky rice. Now I'm going to steam this. It takes a little bit longer because I don't have a proper steamer. <laughs> so it took me like, actually in France when I do this, it took me around one and a half hour, but this time because of the wrong steamer, it took me two hours. And now this is the final product. My breakfast, the suman or the langa with fresh boko.